Hey guys, welcome back to No Catchy Name. It's me, Ella. Today is Saturday. I think the 30th of June. I mean, not June, July. <laughs> and this is June. <laughs> and I wanted to hop on here and show you guys my Christmas stocking I've been working on for my county fair that is in the beginning of September. Um, yeah, it's a free pattern. I forget the whole name of it because it's got a long name. I think it's called the Country Cottage Crochet stocking something like that <laughs> uh but it's by the turtle trunk i think is what it's called <laughs> i'll link it below it's a free pattern like i said and uh they have the instructions for making it with a bulky number five or a number four and i used a number four i used red heart super saver in cherry red and Aaron, and i used a h hook it called for i hook and i just brain farted instead of getting a 5.5 which is i i got a five but i mean it worked out good it still looks like a stocking so i'm happy with it but here it is i like the way it worked out this is like textured it's um it's double crochets and then front post double crochets and uh there's single crochets in there too and i think that's it <laughs> but i really like the way the heel was done it's all made in one piece it's really cool you don't have to like you do have to to well you have to like sew part of the heel together so i'm saying this part right here the gusset i don't know what it's called <laughs> i'm not a sock person but um then you just crochet so that's really neat it's all one big piece though you just attach the yarn you start with the the toe color and then you switch to the stocking color and then you do the heel and then you do the rest of the stocking and then you do the, the uh cuff <laughs> i did just make the little hanger myself i don't know if she had instructions on how to do it I, I, don't, I didn't read past finishing it, but I just went ahead. I just made a chain and like, uh, you know, made a chain. <laughs> so I think it's really cute. It turned out a pretty good size, I think. And I really like the texture on it. So I'm going to enter this in my county fair. Uh, the week that I enter is somewhere towards the end of August. They haven't put out the fair book yet. They should be coming out pretty soon. Um, it's usually the week, the, the Sunday, Saturday or Sunday before the fair starts. And then um, i got to wait a whole week <laughs> to go back and... Um, like figure out what I won. Is that right? Am I telling you the truth or am I lying? <laughs> I can't remember now. No, it's you come a week later to pick up. Yeah, it's the Sunday before the fair starts. So it should be, I don't have a calendar. The fair starts, I think September 2nd. So whatever weekend is before that, whatever weekend day is before that, I go and enter it. And then I think I can go that evening and see if I won. But then I have to leave my, my items there all week because it has to be at the fair, you know, to be, um, you know, viewed <laughs> and then uh i pick it up the day after the fair ends that's what it is see it's been a year i forgot <laughs> but uh so i'm not gonna be entering too many things i'm hoping to enter my christmas blanket right here that i made last uh christmas season i just need to get it lined because i didn't weave in on my ends i, I tied a lot of them <laughs> so i need to line the back of it and i just don't have the fabric on hand to do that i need four yards because i measured it <laughs> uh so i need to pick up um some fleece or something like flannel maybe just something to line the back of that blanket with and then i'm going to enter it and i got a few other little things i'm going to enter not as much as i normally do but um it's just because i've been busy most of this year <laughs> but this is one thing so i'll link the pattern down below if you want to check it out i liked it a lot it worked up really quickly i did mess up the brim because <laughs> i didn't read the pattern i just read the beginning of it and, and went with it and then I ended, it ended up flaring out really bad because i had made too many uh rolls so i had to rip it all out and then go back and fix it the right way but I think it turned out really cute. It's a cute little stocking. What do you think? You approve? Do you like it? Just looking at a big pile of stuff I got over here. But yeah, I just wanted to hop on here real quick and share that with you guys. Uh, tomorrow is the last day of July. Um, and then August is after that, obviously. <laughs> August 1st is Monday. And I'm going to try to do Vlogist, which is where I make a video every day in uh, August. <laughs> and I am just going to do vloggy videos. Um, I'm not going to do anything like special. <laughs> I'm just going to vlog uh, us here <laughs> like I normally do. I've been doing the vlog months ever since, I think, 2017 when I started. I started that year doing vlog must the christmas one and i'm pretty sure i've done it every year <laughs> since then so um it's just a lot of fun to like share parts of our life and then there'll also be crochet videos too so some days there'll be two videos uh and some days there might not be any vlogs because it really depends on life <laughs> but i'm gonna try my hardest to do every day and um i'm gonna do also vlogtober in october and definitely vlog must in december some of that will start in november too because we do christmas stuff in november uh, leading up to Christmas. But anyways, I'm going to hop off here and get this video up real quick because it's already kind of later in the day. 
and then I'm gonna go watch some more of the Waltons. <laughs> I've been watching the Waltons uh, pretty much since she was born. Slowly, I'm on season... Oh, I just got to season seven. I'm on the first episode of season seven. It's the the episode for when Grandpa died, so I'm gonna be crying, but it's okay. It's so sad because the last episode of season six is when Grandma finally comes back after her stroke, and the actress had a stroke in her life. That's why she was gone for so long. So she's not acting like she had a stroke. She literally had a stroke. Uh, and then the next episode is when Grandpa dies, and he because he died in her life as well. So it's just sad. But, you know, it's life, I guess. <laughs> Anyways, when I get done watching that, there's nine seasons and then there's six movies. I don't have the movies, but they're free to watch. I'm pretty sure on Amazon Prime. I do own all the um, the seasons. I bought them. <laughs> um, when did I buy those? Oh, it was one of the stimulus checks last year. <laughs> the last stimulus check, I think. I went ahead and bought all the seasons of the Waltons uh, on Amazon. But we don't have Amazon Prime, but my sister does. So I'll use hers long enough to watch those six movies. <laughs> and then I'll probably start watching Little House on Prairie again. Because uh, that's one of my comfort shows. I always watch it um, in the background when I'm doing stuff. So anyways, I'm blabbing now at this point. <laughs> so I'm going to hop off here. She's looking around at everything. And we're going to get this video edited. And I will see you guys maybe tomorrow for a video. I do have some mail that I could show you. But for sure, I'll see you sometime Monday. Either a crochet video during the day or maybe just a vlog that evening. I'll probably put my vlogs up. Um, it'll be later in the days. So you might actually get to see them. You might have a better chance of watching them the day later. You know, um, Because I'll be filming <laughs> little clips all Monday. And then I'll edit it that evening and get it uploaded. But anyways, she's getting movie. <laughs> so I'm going to try to put her in her high chair and edit this real quick. And I'll see you guys eventually. And I hope you're all having a good weekend so far. And yeah, I guess that's it. <laughs> Bye, guys.